This is a must-read book for anyone who's interested in the development of China. It's almost exactly to the day, 170 years since um, the Communist Manifesto was published in London. You know, frankly speaking, I think a lot of the ideas and thoughts in this book are as important and as relevant um, to modern-day China and actually modern-day uh, global society as um, the work of Marx and Engels was um, back in the mid-19th century. Well, one is peace. His, his basic message is that the history of China, the Confucian history of China, mm -hmm. is peaceful. The second is equality throughout the book. Mm -hmm. It's based on the idea that human beings are equal. And the third idea is his idea of internationalism. Xi Jinping is really the last leader who still believes we should have an international peaceful order. So it is a good read and it is an encouraging read. What President Xi is doing is carrying forward a message that the United Nations was promoting in the 1980s and 90s. How can we preserve the world? President Xi's shared human future is a direct continuation of that, and he is speaking, therefore, to the world as a whole. Uh, th this is much bigger than globalization.